everyone. Welcome to section 02, Understanding Houdini. In this section, you will learn key concepts that will allow you to understand the structure and architecture of this program. These key concepts will also allow you to speed up your learning process. In this first episode, we are going to get and install Houdini. If you are just getting started and do not want to spend money, then you may want to try the Houdini Apprentice version, which is free. If you are already willing to produce 3D content with the lowest possible investment, then you can go with certainty with the Houdini Indie version, which is $269 per year. And if you have a healthy business, then you could go for the full Houdini FX version, which is $2,495 per year, or $4,495 perpetual per artist. Obviously, you get the software from SideFX website. The installation process is basically the same for any version. The only difference is that when you buy the product, you will receive your licenses and the specific instructions for activating the software. For these tutorials, we are going to use mostly the Apprentice version. So let's start getting and installing Houdini Apprentice. First, open your web browser. In the address bar, type sitefx.com and enter. This will guide you to the SiteFX website. From the menu, select Get, then Download. This will guide you to the login page. If you already have an account with SiteFX, then log in by entering your name and your password. Otherwise, you have to create an account. This is a free process. To create an account, you will have to provide the following information. Username A valid email Your first name Your last name A password Retype the password to confirm. Then click on the verification box to agree on the terms of use. If you wish, you could also check the verification boxes to subscribe to the newsletter and to make your user profile visible. Complete the CAPTCHA window to verify you are not a robot. And finally, click on the register button to complete the process. A message will appear on the screen indicating that a verification email has been sent with a link for activating your account. Then open your email and click on the link inside to activate your account. Now you can log in by entering your name and your password. In the download page, click on the download button. This will start the downloading process. Wait for the download to finish and then locate the file. Right click on the executable file and choose to run as administrator. In the setup window, click on the next button. In the License Agreement window, click on the I Agree button. In the Choose Components, leave the defaults and click on the Next button. Click on the Next button. Again, in the Next button. And once more, click on the Next button. Finally, 
click on the install button and wait for the process to finish. In the end, you should choose to reboot your machine now, but just to continue the recording process, I choose to manually reboot later. Click the finish button to complete the process. Now Houdini is installed on your computer and you should be able to see the icons on your desktop. To activate your apprentice version, be sure to have a working internet connection and then click on the Houdini icon to start the program. The Houdini License Administrator window opens and choose to install the free Houdini Apprentice License and click on the next button. Then in the End User License Agreement window, click on the Accept button. After a few seconds, the Houdini License Administrator window opens again with a message indicating that the non-commercial licenses were successfully installed. Click the Run button to start the program. Houdini opens. Allow access to private networks to Houdini in the firewall window. Then select if you want to participate in the usage statistics and click OK. And that's all. You now have Houdini Apprentice licensed and working on your computer. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you soon in the next one.